Hi guys! So today I'm going to be showing you how to do a French side fishtail braid and this is the hairstyle that Katniss wears as the Mockingjay in Mockingjay Part 1 and I don't know if she wears it in Part 2, I haven't seen it yet but I'm super excited to. Let me know below if you have seen it and if she does wear this hairstyle in the second movie. But I just thought this was a really cute hairstyle and I wanted to show you guys how to do it. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So begin by combing out your hair really well and if you want to, sometimes it helps to hold a hairstyle a little bit better if you hairspray it beforehand and then brush it out again. So go ahead and begin with a kind of just a medium side part and then on the side that has more hair, go ahead and about an inch away from the part, grab that section of hair and divide it into two equal pieces. And a French fishtail is basically a regular fishtail except you're going to begin doing a regular fishtail and take a piece from the outer side, take it to the other side piece from the outer side, take it to the other side, but rather than continuing and taking from the same two pieces, you're going to add in pieces. So take a new piece over that front piece, join it with the back piece. New piece over the front piece and join it with that front one. And continue doing this until you've joined about half of your hair into the fishtail braid and make sure that as you're going, you're pulling this tight. To your head. We are going to loosen it up later, but in order for it to sit right when we do the final fishtail, you need to pull it tight to your head. So once you've joined in about half of your hair, go ahead and do a few more fishtail sections down. This is just going to help hold it in place for when we join the two fishtails together. Once you've done a few fishtails down, go ahead and secure it loosely with a small elastic band. Now to begin the other side, basically Begin by doing the exact same thing. Take about an inch section of hair, divide it in half, and start doing your French fishtail. Once you've reached where it's uncomfortable to go any farther back, Go ahead and switch your hands around, pull the rest of your hair behind your head, and continue fishtailing, French fishtailing, behind your head all the way to where your other one sits on the side of your head. Once you have joined all of your hair into the braid, go ahead and continue doing a few loops down of a regular fishtail. So once you have reached all the way around your head, go ahead and just join that whole fishtail together into one piece. Take the rubber band out of the other piece. So once you've got that out, go ahead and take a piece from that first fishtail, take it over, and join it with the back fishtail. Now take a piece from the back fishtail over, 
and do it. And basically, you've turned each of these individual fishtails into one side of one fishtail. So continue doing a regular fishtail all the way down to the bottom of your hair. Okay, so once you've finished fishtailing all the way down to the bottom, secure it with a small elastic band, and then it's time to start loosening it up and making it look a little bit fuller and messier the way that she had it in the movie. And obviously, you can pull it apart as little or as much as you want, but I prefer mine really messy and full looking. Now, as you can see, I pulled mine apart a lot and made it look really messy, but I feel like it's easier that way because then you don't have to worry about keeping it looking really clean as you go, and you can just let it kind of go its own crazy way and not have to worry about it. So once you like the way it's pulled apart, go ahead and take some hairspray and just do a quick little finish off to hold it all in place. And once you're done with that, you are all finished. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe and follow me on all the social medias. If you recreate this hairstyle in any sort of way, please either tag me in a picture that you post or send me a picture. I would love to see it. Also, tell me down in the comments below any more hair tutorials that you would like to see in the future. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!